You can call it heaven, since the only thing about it is a blue sky that tries to cover her naked body with veils of clouds, supported by pillars of mountains rising beyond limits of gravity. Someone may call it a dream, but for someone, it's a home. And that someone is us who lives there. The heavenly palace in the midst of all the beauties in heaven, the Sabaragamu University of Sri Lanka. With the purpose of fulfilling the global knowledge requirements of Sri Lanka, as a developing country in the globe, Sabaragamu University of Sri Lanka had begun its journey on 17th of September in 1991 as an affiliated university. The way that sun hugs here in the morning is unlike any other place on earth that we can assure. The slight warmth of morning sun combined with morning cloud and dew is beyond any sensation that can be compared with any way that someone can ever feel. The burning flames that the sunset gives to the shadows of Hagala is a scenery that no other place can offer you. Even though it was started in three different locations as subdivisional faculties in Buttala, Rahangala and Pelihuan. Later on, 5th of November in 1995, these three separated families were reunited under one shelter to form the Sabaragamu University of Sri Lanka that you see today. The present family of Sabaragamu consists of six major members, the Faculty of Applied Sciences, the Faculty of Agricultural Sciences, the Faculty of Geomatics, Faculty of Management Studies, the Faculty of Social Sciences and Languages, and the Faculty of Graduate Studies are those members. These six faculties of the university are now marching forward with the unity of one in order to achieve the common goals and overcome the challenges that blocks their path with the prime duty of creating undergraduates empowered with knowledge, skills and attitudes required to build our nation. The Faculty of Applied Sciences, the tech giant of the university, was started with just two departments at first place in a rural area of Buttala, but in present it is a house for five departments with a platoon of approximately 1000 students.
can you share your thoughts about faculty of applied sciences? Yeah, I actually love to share my thoughts on uh, my faculty and uh, it's one of the actually prominent faculty out of those six faculties. This faculty initially started at the Buddha, it is a little far from this place where we are now. And uh, then it was shifted to this uh, premises Beliulwen, it is with a very good scenic beauty. And this faculty we have five departments out of which we offer 10 degree programs and uh, those departments are Department of Computing and Information Systems where we offer uh, computer science uh, and IT related degree and uh, uh, the other one is uh, Department of Sports Science and Physical Education uh, from that department we offer Sports Science degree as well as Physical uh, Education degree and uh, we have a depart another department called Department of Natural Resources where we offer a degree, uh, on BSA degree on natural resource management and uh, we have another uh, department, uh, it is also a uh, very special department uh, um, this, is, this department, in, uh, we are the one who uh, started this degree program in uh, food science and technology uh, in Sri Lanka and uh, also we have another department, Department of Physical Sciences from that we offer um, degrees on this, uh, special degrees on uh, physical technology, chemical technology, and also computer science. Uh, this so faculty, we uh, have very well uh, trained uh, academic staff uh, as well as uh, uh, non academic staff and academic supportive staff. Uh, and also, we have uh, updated uh, lecture theatres and laboratories for all the disciplines. Another one thing I would like to share. Our employee is 100%. So I uh, also would like to invite uh, those who would like to join the faculty in future to come and receive the faculty and come and join us. As for the Department of CIS, it provides the degree program BSc Honours in Information Systems. So can you say something about this department? Yeah, uh, actually the BSc Special Degree Program in Computing and Computer System is a uh, was initiated in uh, 2008, but our department was established in 2011. And uh, actually, we have developed our curriculum according to the ACM multiple uh, guidelines. And uh, we are offering subjects to information system like uh, MIS, Micro Information System, and IT Auditing, and uh, the Micro Information System and Practice. And not only that, we are offering subjects related to software engineering like. Uh, Software project management, quality excellence, and uh, software engineering also. And again, uh, we are offering a network theory subject also. And uh, in the third year, our students have to go to industry for industrial training. And in the end of the industrial training, they have to uh, provide the uh, industrial training report. So, with that course, you know, student can get uh, industry experience. And again, in the fourth year, students have to do a research project. So, at the end of that research project, uh, they have to provide a thesis. So I think with, it, with that uh, course unit also students get uh, experience in the research field and they can uh, do some postgraduate studies after the uh, uh, graduate, after the graduate. And then uh, uh, if I talk about the employment rate of our students, uh, I'm happy to say that it is uh, now more than uh, 90%. The department has already sent out a legacy of five successful bachelors of undergraduates to the industry since 2007. Not only handling theoretical knowledge, but also they are quite open-minded and skilled in applying what they have learned, combined with the innovativeness to develop new technologies required in different disciplines even such as using Arduino for music and drone technology. Furthermore, to build up technical skills and personality of the students, they have come up with their own unique set of programs such as Fortnite Meta, Codenight Mini Hackathon, We Are the Gaming Program, Let Me Hack the Hackathon. Could you tell me the achievements that you have made as a department? Yes. 
Apart from the academic perseverance, us as the Department of Computing and Information System were able to achieve a lot in the IT industry. CIS really stands for providing creative innovative solutions to the industry. And the most recent achievement is two students from our department were able to take part in the Google Summer of Code 2017. And the team of the Ronins, they were the first runners up at the IFS Code Comeback Hackathon in 2017. And if I tell about the Team Break IT, they were the runners up at the Cloud Hack 2017. And two girls' teams from our department were able to rank the second and third places at the Sheik Codress Women's Hackathon, which was organized by the IEEE branch of ULS University. And meanwhile, Last year, only one scholar was selected to take part in the Grasshopper celebration which was held at Florida at USA. So, other than those achievements, we were able to bring up the IEEE Congress to our university. So, it's a giant step in our university history. So, within this short period of time, we have achieved a lot as a university. One thing is for sure that we will never be stopped until we become the best, until we thrive upon our glory. We are Sabra CIS family. <laughs>